Good morning, what's good? We out here, welcome back to the channel. It's Sean, out again in the Peak District. So today I'm joined by Greg, I'll link his channel below. We've got Lou, and also my mate Kyle uh, Head. So you might recognize Kyle from some videos where we've been at Crib Gok, but also at Force Cave. So today should be a shorter walk, it's only gonna be sort of five, six miles, but it's gonna hopefully uh, get another two trigs for the Trig 88 challenge. Um, date today, 17th of Jan, 2022, I believe. Uh, it's the day after the Stanage walk that I did with Craig, Alex, and Johnny. That should already be up on the channel. Uh, I'll leave a link somewhere up here for it, so do check that out. That was a class walk. Got the drone out, collected, uh, well, there's three trigs on that. I already had one, um, so I got an extra two yesterday, and there's gonna be two today. So Blacker Plantation, which is where we are now, uh, and Flask Edge as well. So yeah, it should be five, six miles today. So it doesn't look too hard in terms of the incline or declines. The only issue might be uh, underfoot, because it's quite boggy uh, where we are, but weather looks great, um, chilly, but dry, clear, great hiking conditions. Bought the drone again, so I'll potentially uh, get that out when I can. And let's see what this hike is saying. Let's go. So I know in the videos I've been collecting the trigs, haven't really done a, a sit down update on where I am. I know um, I've done one of those before, where I've got the spreadsheet out, all the different printouts that you can get. Um, but as a quick update, today I should be able to get um, 20 seconds. So a quarter of the way through the 88. I know Alex is flying through on the 40s. You know, some people that I go out with have actually done it all. Uh, but I'm getting there. But what I love most about this challenge is it's just taking me to completely new places in the peaks. I keep saying this in these videos. But by doing the challenge, you will go to areas you otherwise probably wouldn't have gone to. You know, for instance, today, uh, the car parking is near Fox House, which I've been to loads of times in the Peak District. It's my side of Sheffield, so it's an area of the Peak District I know quite well. Didn't know about it. <laughs> Didn't know about this Blacker Plantation. Um, so again, you're just discovering more walks and more areas, really. Um, and by doing this, you know, you do different routes, you understand routes you could bring somebody who's experienced, maybe somebody who's trying to get into the, the hiking scene. So yeah, you're just kind of building up a portfolio of Peak District walks by doing the uh, the Trig 88 challenge. So if it's something you haven't thought too much about um, or actually don't know what it is, go back through my old videos, find one where I do a bit of a sit down about telling you what it is, you know, where it will take you and uh, give you a little bit more information on that. So yeah, hopefully you get the 20 seconds done today and I'm a quarter way through the challenge. Lou, why don't you just stand here? Lou, shall we get some photos, would you? I'm going round to it. All of us get chased off. Careful, mate. Number 22, Blacker Plantation, let's go. Big man, give us a wave. There he is. Holman. Can't see, but. <laughs> and then Lou back over there. So I see what the light's like here. Oof, it's in my eyes. Yeah, first one of the day, Blacker Plantation. About what, five, 10 minutes from when we started? Maybe 15, 20. So not a hard one to get at all. On to the next, let's go. Two, what are we, Lou? Two, two and a half? Two, 2.7. 2 2.7 miles in, probably around halfway now. And the next trick is up over that hill, Flask Edge. Guys having a bit of a, a wardrobe change. Craig's got the jacket off, going tees. Car's got the fleece off. Lou's loading up on wafer bar. Brunch bar, chock chip. Brunch bar, let's get it. Fueled up, let's go. So yeah, up that hill, second trick of the day. Job done. Biker over the shoulder, getting it in. Yeah. Good walk so far. Let's carry on. Um, <laughs> <laughs> that is class. So on top of the moor now, some good views. You probably won't be able to see because the GoPro's on the wide lens. It's probably too far away, but Sheffield over the shoulder. Just panoramic up here. Standage would be over there. Just a little bit too high. This is 
is what the terrain is like though. Pretty boggy. Absolute bleak low vibes is what I'd call it. But all in all, yeah, quite easy to get around. And on the way to Flasco, it shouldn't take us too much longer. Just runners out here, bikes, and you probably saw at the start of the clip somebody on a unicycle. Fair play, lad. Flask Edge, uh, let's go. Yeah. Chris got the touch in. All about the touch. She's in. So, right, what can we see up here? Oh, Stanage she over there, look. Sheffield there. Stanage. Sheffield. Pole. It's quite like a central place for like runs you can see. Did you say no, poles. So. Oh. Flask <laughs> <laughs> Edge. This is definitely going to test the wind muffler. Hopefully you can still hear me. It's really windy up here on top of the trig at Flask Edge. It seems like quite a central place. There's paths all over that I mean here. You see a ton of runners as well. I don't want to talk for too long in case you can't actually hear me, but yeah, second and final trig of the day today. Flask Edge. Now back to the car, I think. Let's go. Ah, I'm not sure of the light in here, but we're on the track back to the car. Lou, how, how long have we done or how much have we done so far? Oh, shit, we're literally back at the car. Did not realise. Um, so we're literally back at the car. I didn't realise how quick that was. Um, so yeah, might as well just kind of sign out here. Kyle, what are you saying? Easy, Easy one, here. that, yeah. Nice Sunday stroll. Yeah, yeah, that's a great way to summarise it. A bit of a Sunday stroll on the peaks. If you're doing your tree bag in, you can bag two. There was nothing hard about that, was there? Was Only three the hours, condition. maybe? Yeah, three hours. The only thing I would say is maybe the conditions underfoot is a little bit, yeah, little bit muddy here and there. For this one, either. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but as I say, there's been people out here that are walking the dogs. We've seen brother. Actually, there's been a bit of a, I don't know, fell race or something going on today as well. Yeah. But a guy in a unicycle. <laughs> the unicycle guy. I can't get this light right. I'm not, that's actually better. Sorry, so the light is actually probably a little bit better here. Craig, Lou, come here a minute. Yo, Craig, I'm going to sign out here. So how long have we been on that for? Two hours, 12 minutes. So you absolutely smashed it. Two hours, 12 minutes, two trigs. Not sure if Craig will do a video. He'd sooner video on today's like. Yeah, there'll be a short one. Yeah, so I'll link his channel below. Lou, let it. Thank you for that. Good to see you, Kyle. Um, yeah, that'll be that for today. Subscribe if you haven't already. Give the video a like. Get me to a thousand subs. I'm nearly there. Come on. Maybe I'm there already by the time of the video. But if not, if you could subscribe, it really helps. And I'll see you guys in another Peak District video. See you later. Bye.